Today, I'm gonna open packs from every single Madden. Now, unfortunately, they took off the servers for Madden 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. But that's okay because we just have to go even harder for the Maddens we do have. Starting with Madden 20. I'm sure you guys recall my video, the greatest pack opening of all time ever. It's my fifth most viewed video ever. For whatever reason, there was a week of Madden 20 where golden tickets ran rampant. I've never even seen anything like it since. Now, granted, I don't think those golden tickets are still in the store. Ooh, and I'm kind of broke. Wait, I'm broke. You think if I sold something on the auction house, people would buy it? My team is insane. I have two golden ticket quarterbacks. I got a golden ticket tight end, Zach Gentry. <laughs> oh, I love this team. Oh, Corey Schleisinger, Schleisinger's goat. Dude, I remember this guy. I got Barry Ingram Cook. On defense, I got golden ticket Brian Dawkins, golden ticket Megatron, golden ticket Anthony Barr, golden ticket Taylor Mays. Holy shit. What are players on Madden 20 selling for? I gotta make some coins. What's the cheapest golden ticket? Oh my God. What? And Quincy and Unwa. That's a golden ticket. That is such a mid golden ticket. 95 speed, bro. I've got that uh -huh. right now in Madden 23. Ooh, this RG3 is nasty. I remember that RG3. Muhammad Sanu quarterback. Joshi Poo. Card art does go hard, though. Got RG3 golden ticket. Adrian Peterson golden ticket. Anthony Barr golden ticket. I got Trey Ed. Why do I have so many golden tickets? What was this from? Oh, dude, I forgot about this. The most feared Ray Lewis was such an awesome card. That's so dumb. Dope. Hey, Trey Edmonds sold. Dude, no. like, who is on Madden 20 right now? Just picking off golden tickets. Although this was one of the best Maddens in a long time, so I understand it. Can I still pull, like, crazy high overalls out of this? There's this 86-plus overall draft player pack. And there's the theme builders MVPs who are 97 overalls. Not a lot in the training store. I'm actually going to open these. I'm trying to remember who these were. I think this is, like, ooh, kind of a dope <laughs> John Brown. I kind of forgot about John Brown. Yeah, he's fast as hell. 96 speed. Okay. All right. I want to do, wanna do a few more of these. I want to see what we got cooking in the theme builders MVPs. Deion Jones, okay. How good was he? 91 speed, 6'1". Not bad. Skirt, love the animation. Alex Mack. Come on, come on. Who's the Lions player? I don't remember Melvin Ingram. Who's now on the Chiefs, right? I don't know. What else? 97 Quinton Dunbar, dude. Quinton Dunbar. There's gonna be some classics in here, dude. I'm starting to remember Tahir Whitehead. I'm pretty sure the Lions drafted Tahir Whitehead, and then we traded him to the Raiders, and I don't know who he plays for now. 99 tackle, 99 play rec, 96 block shed, 95 hit power. That is an insane middle linebacker. Okay, Mike Evans. Holy shit. Well, he's still on the Buccaneers. Six foot five, 91 speed, 99 catcher traffic, 98 spectacular catch. That's a good one. Ooh. Ooh, Damien Williams. I'm free. I literally forget about all these guys. Damien Williams was actually a monster in that Super Bowl. He could have gotten Super Bowl MVP. They gave it to Mahomes because it's a popularity contest, though. I mean, you're not <laughs> wrong. Can I show you the coolest thing ever? Dr. Squatch made a Justin Herbert soap bar. I think my favorite part, actually, is this right here. Zero grit? I don't know, man. I feel like Justin Herbert has a little bit of grit. Well, if you can't tell, I'm excited to continue to partner with Dr. Squatch on today's video. Dr. Squatch makes incredible, high-performing, natural men's hygiene products. And their flagship product is their bars of soap. They smell amazing. It's my go-to every time I shower. And they have so many different scents. I know you're going to love one. And with the holiday season coming up, this might be the best gift option. They have awesome holiday deals. They even have holiday bundles with some of my favorite scents that they ever drop. I usually load up on the holiday scents because it reminds me of the holidays. They also make some other great products too, like their shampoo and conditioner and their deodorant. And my personal favorite bar of soap is Pine Tar. I have so many bars of Pine Tar just in case. And I have an extra special holiday discount for you guys so you can try Dr. Squatch for yourself. New customers can get 25% off on orders of $40 or more using my code DSQMMG25. So use my code DSQMMG25 and click the link in the top of the description. Dr. Squatch, thanks for sponsoring today's video, guys. Enjoy the rest.
86 plus overall draft player. I want to see if I can like randomly pull something insane. Oh, completely forgot about that animation. That shit goes hard. Oh, this is back in the day when there was actually different animations. If you pulled something really good, I'm pretty sure. So I should know the minute I get something really good. There's Ultimate Legends, Fantasy Packs, Game Changers, Legends, and Elite Player Packs. Let's just open all of them. Dude, it would be so sick if Golden Tickets were still in packs, so I have to imagine they aren't. That's the that's the big legend animation. That's Ultimate Legend? Oh, that's core gold i'm poverty that's ultimate legend autogram all right elite player pack game changer pack dude if i pull a golden ticket i'm actually gonna go fucking ballistic micah high damar dotson that's playoffs Kenny Vaccaro. And a legend, Charles Tillman. You know what I love when I go back to these old Maddens on a next-gen console is you notice how fluid it is. Like, look at how fluid the animations are, how quickly I move from screen to screen. What's so sad about Madden every single year is it's always, like, too clunky for the operating device. Does that make sense? Game Changer Pack. James Washington. Teron Armstead. Tony G. Oh! Oh, that's a Redux, right? Oh! Oh, my God! This is literally one of my favorite cards of all. Oh, my God. This is one of my favorite cards of all time. Number one, they did a throwback to the Bo Jackson card art from Madden 15. Number two, this was the first limited I ever pulled. I remember to this day pulling this limited Bo Jackson sitting in my apartment at Michigan State my senior year. This is literally one of my favorite cards ever, dude. I'm so fucking glad I just pulled this because he'll be on this team for forever now. I couldn't have asked for anything better. Let's go. Hayden Hurst, Janovich. Oh, another Redux. Fire Series Redux. Those are really cool ones. Aaron Donald, Kurt Warner. Dude, Series Redux used to go so much harder, too. Series Redux now is so fucking mid. Like, they clearly don't give a shit about it. I used to get fucking amped like that. When I see that animation, I used to get amped. That is the Blitz Black Friday Darren Waller. That is a dope one right there. I'm definitely picking up that Darren Waller. All right, little ultimate legend, Marcus Allen, Otto Graham, Rob Gronkowski. All right, you know what? I'll end on Madden 20 when I pull a 95 or better. The 95 are better. Steve Young, Mel Blunt, Bruce Matthews, Amir Abdullah, Sam Darnold. That is not a 95 or better. Series Redux! I love seeing it. Oh, that Team of the Week Rogers. Dude, that card art goes fucking dummy, too. I don't know why they switched Team of the Week to this black and white silver bullshit, dude. Look at that. 429 yards, six tutties, Aaron Rodgers. Ooh, that's such a sick pull. Come on, give me a Redux. Oh, that's uh, Super Bowl? Yeah, Super Bowl pass. That's Zero Chill. Should be a Wujie? Ken Houston, Jacoby Myers. All right. <gasps> NFL 50. Oh, or NFL 100 is what it was. And that's not the big animation. That was the small animation. There's like a super try hard NFL 100 animation. And that gets you a 94, 95. Those were the players that basically invented the X Factor. Those players started with their X Factor on and it never turned off the whole game. Flashbacks? Flashbacks. Why'd they take that out of the game? EA is the king of like adding something and then taking it out. Troy Palomar, like what about superstar mode, bro? We used to have fucking superstar mode. And like Madden 08, we don't even have that shit anymore. Playing old Madden just makes me hate EA even more, actually. EA's like a super hot chick at the bar who keeps like eyeballing you and flirting with you, but you know damn well you're never gonna take it home and actually lay the pipe. Because every single Madden, you know, they tease you with something, one little thing. And you're like, damn, they might actually be on the right track. I might actually take EA home and pipe him or her. And then you never do. But you keep going back to that same bar every single weekend in hopes that one day you might actually lay the pipe. But you never do. I'm gonna be honest, I don't actually think that's a good analogy at all. All right, give me my 95, baby. I'll take a redux. Montez Sweat, that card goes hard. It's like one of the fastest linebackers in the game at the time. Nobody plays the game anymore. You can give me a 95. John Ross, draft player. Ooh, Matabuike. Ooh, big X. Oh! Holy shit. I was looking for a 95. I got a gold 99. Holy shit. Goal 99, Patrick Willis. 94 speed, 97 hit power, 94 block shed, 6 foot 1. Fucking monster. Let's go. All right, we'll end Madden 20 off on that. And I've got 1.1 million coins in case I ever want to do it again. Madden 21, I got banned. So I actually can't log into Madden 21 with this account. It's actually the reason I made XX Haver 69. Damn, I'm kind of broke here too. Why am I so broke, Matt? I got 50k training. I got 273k. What's my item binder look like? Ooh, wait. Wait a minute. Was this the Madden when I lived in Hawaii? This is the Madden when I lived in Hawaii. And I did like a 2 million training opening. Yeah, I totally remember now. Wait, do they still have that pack in the store? I would love to do that pack over any other pack. Please tell me I have training variety. You have to have training variety. Yes! Oh, 
dude. This is the year they just went fucking bonkers. Look at Madden 20's training store compared to this, bro. They got everything. Woo! And they got training variety. Dude, these training variety packs. Oh, wait a second. Maybe not. Can you not pull golden tickets in these? Yeah, veterans players, legends, team of the year. I could have sworn there was one you could get golden tickets in, but that doesn't say you could get golden tickets. Hey, I'm thinking Madden 22. Fuck it. Let's just go with the fan appreciation bag. Fan appreciation bags are actually really dope because they have a huge array of players in them. Let's just see what we can pull on this. Starting out with an ultimate legend. Ooh, love that animation. 89 Tony G, middle linebacker. NFL draft, Daquan Jones. Series Redux, that's a good one. Ayuk. All right. No, this is totally the one I'm thinking of. I swear you can pull golden tickets in those. I'm going to keep doing the fan appreciation bags though because these are dope. But legend, Steve Smith, a gold, another gold, an ultimate legend, Adelius Thomas, and another draft <laughs> What? Dude, it's not a left field. Like, what? 98 speed, 98 jump. Now that's a goal 99. TJ Moore. Oh my God. I'll use you for your 100K training, sir. Thank you very much. Don't mind if I do. All right, let's do an Ultimate Legends fantasy pack. We'll switch it up a little bit. Call an audible. Jimbo. What are you doing, Jimbo? Gold, gold. Richard Seymour. Decent. Round two. Kwan Short. Julio. An Ultimate Legend player. Jim Thorpe. Rocking the sweater. I respect it. And Leonard Floyd. The topper. We got a free safety. Brian Dawkins. And we got Bruce. Bruce Matthews. All right. Nothing special. Ooh, the zero chill goes so hard. I loved opening those. All right. Let's do some training packs. I'm going to do like 10 training variety packs here. Remember the hellhole that was power up players? Literally every single player and their mother had to have a power up player. If you wanted the best version, you had to go buy the power up player, add all of the versions that are on the auction house, and it would take like 20 minutes just to get the card that you wanted. I am so glad they got rid of that. Team of the week, Randy Gregory. That's actually a dope pull. What a Loser. Bunch of nonsense in those training varieties. I'm done with that. Let's open one of each of the training packs. So 89 plus veterans, Jonathan Joseph. Okay, actually, no, I can't just get an 89. Let's go. Let's go get a heater. Yeah. Is there a different animation for the good ones? Frank Gore. Come on. Give me the big animation, right? Isn't there one? Oh, there definitely isn't. That's 96 Danny Amendola. Good pull. Kind of forgot we had him on the Lions. Did players literally go to the Lions just to like end their career? They're like, oh, the Lions will give me five mil to do literally nothing thing and lose a bunch of games sick 89 plus player of the week oh this does have some heat this has some heat in it i'm remembering it's, it's all coming back to me baby tyler lockett not bad but i know i know there's a fucking monster waiting in here for me let's go boys let's go boys come on darius williams it's a nasty corner for a while deck back attack come on i gotta get a 93 plus gotta get a 93 plus right chase claypool 89 plus flashback love that little retro alex mack here <laughs> Love that animation too, Richie Incognito. Rising Stars. Oh, I miss Rising Stars. This was a really cool promo. It was all the really good young guys. They got that Jedi animation, AJ Terrell. Like, why would you take out something as cool as flashbacks and Rising Stars? Like, 94 Derek Carr. Okay. 89 plus Rising Stars. Brian Burns. Franchise God. And I'll just do a little Campus Heroes play. I don't expect much anything good here. But I'm gonna go get a little more training and do... Wow, I got LeVar Arrington twice. Final flashback pack. I'm gonna go quick sell some, and I want to keep opening that team of the week, because I know that there's insane cards in there. I don't know who. I don't remember who, but I know it's nasty. I know that much. Let's look at all of the team of the year players from Madden 21, because I believe this fantasy pack has all of them. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Dalvin Cook. Yup, he was on my squad because he was a prestige. Darren Waller. Monster. Diggs. Jay Jettas, dude. It's not that much different. Trent Williams. He'll probably get it again this year, too. Bosa. Cam Hayward. Chris Jones. Khalil Mack. Levante David. Demario Davis. Xavier Howard. Bryce Callahan. Jamal Adams. Jesse Bates. Oh, Jesse Bates. He was a god. Patty Ricard. Jason Sanders. Jack Fox. Dude, the card art was so sick. They did like a little gold, like gold on the cleats or gold on their arms. I would definitely be taking Darren Waller here. Darren Waller is a goat. Madden 20 is on the clock. Wait, did I just say Madden 20? Oh my God, I'm an Madden 22 is on the clock. Let's get it. Madden loyalty fantasy pack. I was just given a fantasy pack right now for Madden 22. What? What? I only get one pick this round. A Super Bowl player? What the fuck? Wait, this 
pack is sick. So gold 99 Josh Allen, gold 99 Cooper Cup, a series Redux player, gold 99 Sean Taylor, another, it's gotta be a gold 99 draft player, JC Horn, and another gold 99 Redux. Holy shit. How are you gonna make me choose out of this? Holy shit. Fuck it, dude. I'm going with that Lawrence Taylor. I'm not gonna play a game of Madden 22. I don't know why I'm thinking about it like that, but it's just so cool to get. Wow. Well, I've got two million training, one million coins. We've got a lot that we can do. Let's start out with fan appreciation packs. Team of the week, for sure. KJ Osborne, a series redux. Probably not a gold 99. 95 Keyshawn Johnson, though. That's a big draft player. So when you get that animation, I think it's 95 plus. Series redux could be anything. 93 Montez Sweat, badass. Darius Leonard. Oh, I thought they said 96. Still a nasty pack. Man, it feels like the Madden 22 packs are way more juiced than any of the other year's endgame packs. So that's a low draft player. That is a 92. Benson Mayoa. Rising Stars. Rashad Bateman, 96. Yeah, these are a lot more cracked than the other ones, dude. Jason Kelsey. Ah, my prestige. This is the training variety pack that could give you a golden ticket. I think on average, it took me like 200,000 training to pull a golden ticket before. I'm gonna pull a bunch here. Let's see if we can actually somehow finesse a golden ticket. Like, I literally remember doing the 10 million training opening. I think it took me six or seven hours. On average, every 500,000 training was a golden ticket. I was gonna just casually open packs here and there, but now that I realize this training variety pack does have golden tickets. I'm actually gonna stay here until we pull a golden ticket. So if any of you remember golden tickets from Madden 22, try and place your guess as to who my pull is gonna be. Jay Herbo. I actually have my Herbo. This is not a sponsored video. I just happen to have this on my desk. Another Redux. I'm gonna do it, baby. I'm gonna do it. Mike Haynes. Shaq Barrett. Nice. There he is. Dante Fowler. All right, this is our first really big bull. 97 night train lane. But it's not a golden ticket. Redux. Digs. Oh, another big one. I didn't actually see the reveal on this. Who is it? 97 Phil Sims. I. I'll take it. Lots of Redux. No golden tickets yet, though. Series Redux. Oh, my God. <laughs> You know what's funny? This is technically a golden ticket. This is very much technically, this is a golden ticket, Tom Brady, but I'm not counting that. I want to see the golden ticket animation. Damn, though, that's a crazy pull. A good 400, maybe 500,000 trading in, and we have taken nothing but L's. Although, I guess the Brady pull is pretty dope. Ooh, 97 Jamar Chase. That's actually a fire card. Redux, Redux, Redux. Nick Chubb, all right. I'm gonna cry. If we, if we hit a mill, no golden ticket, I'm gonna cry, bro. My third, it's so sick. It's honestly so sick. That's my third gold 99, no golden ticket. How? Dude, I, I, I literally feel like they're out of the packs now. I don't know. Has anybody loaded up Madden 22 recently, pulled the golden ticket? Or I'm just getting clapped. I could just be getting clapped. I'm pulling full legends. I'm pulling gold 99s. I'm pulling everything that is in a golden ticket. <laughs> This is taking so long, it's a new day. As a viewer, you can't tell, but I change shirts and stuff, you know? I poured over a million trade to get to this, but I said I'd get a gold ticket, so I'm not quitting. Wish me luck, gentlemen. Honestly, if they could throw me a bone here, even just the most minor bone in college. Ticket is Colin Johnson. Definitely not who I expected. Definitely excited about it. Colin Johnson, I spent about 1.7 million training to get you, so you better be a stud. Oh my god. Oh, I forgot about this. This is like one of the best golden tickets in the game. Somebody made a Colin Johnson golden ticket because he's so massive. 97 speed, 99 jump, six foot six. Sheesh. I finally did it. What if I just hit the back to back though? All that waiting for a back to back golden ticket? No. Oh, we did it. It only took two days, but we did it. Got some serious golden tickets on this squad, dude. Yikes. Matt Ariza, yikes. All right, boys, we can finally move on to Madden 23. Let's just open everything Madden 23 has to offer right now. They do have their own version of the training variety pack, but yeah, I don't know. You guys might've seen a video recently where I opened a ton of these. You basically just get a ton of platinum players, which is pretty cool. You know, you get some coins, but it does have a chance at 89 to 91 Redux and limited players when available, but I have never been able to get such luck. I will take the two platinum players though, free coins, I guess. There's the all Madden Elite 
Street pack, which could technically have one of the 93 overall all Madden players. Montana, Saquon's, and come on, do it for me. Do it for me. Hey! <laughs> Wait, that's so awesome. That's actually such a sick pull. I mean, I did make coins. There's a little bit of a profit. Plus, I got Saquon and Montana. But uh -huh. that's not actually as good as I thought it was. There's Team of the Week packs. I got Isaiah Simmons. That Isaiah Simmons is actually really good. Isaiah Simmons and McCole Hardman. McCole Hardman's got a lot of cards. Ooh, I love the AKA packs, bro. I might I might open actually a good amount of AKA packs. See if I can somehow get one of the full, full AKA players, dude. They go so hard. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Ooh, Shady McCole. Shady McCoy might be my favorite, dude. At least card art wise. EK Metcalf. And our AK player. Oos, oos, oos. Sweetness, 84. I'll do one more for Madden 23. You guys know Madden 23 packs, though, right? You should. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Shady again. Cam Jordan, not bad. There's the Elite Legends packs. Not really my favorite. I don't like the Legends this year. They're not very exciting. Like, I'm gonna get some bozo I've never heard of. Okay, Ooh. never mind. Luke Kuechly's actually an awesome legend. I'm sorry. Jamal Dean, Herman Moore, Avante. That was actually a pretty good pack. All right, I'm talking shit for no reason. I'm surprised they still have Most Feared packs in the store. All right, I do like these a lot. Thought Most Feared was a dope drop, dude. They had some really cool cards in there. McCall Hartman, I'm telling you, bro, he's got like a billion cards. Byron Jones, Curtis Samuel, Sterling Hoff, three cards. To conclude this video, I'm going to open 10 training variety packs. That'll be our send-off. Starting out with a rare strategy item. Not actually bad. 26k coins. Moving into a platinum player. It's Corey Davis. 9,000 coins. Jermaine Pratt. Nice. Great animation. <laughs> Next-gen console newest game, ladies and gentlemen. Adrian Phillips. 87 overall. That's a monster pull. 140k. All right. Okay. And we'll get Najee Harris. Who else? Who else? Chris Jones. <laughs> Damn, we're going off. All right. This is a good send off right now. Oh my God. Another platinum player. It's Matthew Judon. These are going so hard. Dude, usually you just get all 80s. 87, 87, 85. I'm just going to clean out my training with these. That Come on. Come on. Oh, it's the non athletic Dalton Schultz. Darn. The last pack of all Madden pack openings. It's a rare strategy item. It's Buffalo Bills. That's a pretty dope team to end it off on. All right, boys. I hope you enjoyed. I have officially opened packs in every single Madden that you can open packs in. And we even pulled a golden ticket. Pulled a lot of gold 99s too, actually, in general. That was a blast. So much fun. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.